We back, baby. Smoking sports. You dig? Week two after the hurricane, you feel me? We still trying to get it together. You dig? It's going down tomorrow. But look, see? it's going down tomorrow. <laughs> we coming back. John Curtis, call. High school football tag on the ESPN2, 6 o'clock Central Time. ESPN2, man. ESPN2, but still try to go. You know. Man, this going to be so loud. You ain't going ESPN2, bro. Not ESPN15, not 16, mm-hmm. ESPN UZ7. Mm-hmm. No. ESPN2, John Curtis call tomorrow. Well, when y'all see this. It's going down. You, you did. Know they only John Curtis like, call. Call only beat them like one time in these last. <laughs> Ten years, maybe they got them. They one. play every year. They 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 they, 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 they they've been playing every year like the last four years, I think. But like they ain't missing too many years playing. Right, they, I they know been they've like, been playing each other. They've been playing each other a good bit. The series like seven and one. Yeah, the man. series like six and one or something. You know what I'm saying? And last year they really beat them on two bombs. Like two number two caught the ball before halftime. The one that's going to Florida State and Aaron Anderson, the one that's that not, he caught the little pass like so. You know, I'm, I, it, 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 it's interesting. And then I don't know caught quarterback situation. Man, I seen for the scrimmage, bro. They had the backup quarterback. They ain't look too hot. Somebody sent a video to my phone. They ain't look too hot. But with all this time going past and the hurricane, they missed two games. Ain't been practicing so, dude. Ain't been on that leg. He might be ready. But at the same time, Bryce might be trying to protect his championships, you know what I'm saying? Bryce might be like, man, you know, I'm still ain't playing him, even though we play. Carl got talent. So, you know, I feel like if if if, if he not if, Right, and Carl didn't not, play yet. Like, yeah, if, if he not I think not, Curtis and plays a couple of games yeah. or something. If 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 he uh if he not like ninety percent or better, don't bring him. Don't even don't don't even mess with that. If he's ready, he's ready. You know. You hear me? I hope he, you know, I but hope he's ready game, where it could be a full. At the end of the day, this game ain't for nothing but bragging rights. Yeah, it's on ESPN too, you know. I know he would want to play if he good. Yeah. But um yeah, we got John Curtis caught, man. ESPN two. We're gonna move on to oh, some yeah. more. One more thing for the What the, you got? It's going over. It's going over. They oh, scoring. Yeah, I can't really expose it. I don't got the line. I don't yeah. got the line. I don't <laughs> got the line. <laughs> we gonna catch. Oh. If, you, if you into that, yeah, slide in the DM. I got you. I don't got the line. I, I can't the line you know, for the Curtis Cup yeah, game. Yeah, you know what's going on. So I can't really. Um, you know what I'm saying? I won't get on. You know what I'm saying? Man, that's wild. Yeah, boy, look. Got, it's going over to over and under about sixty. You did. You did. You know they gonna score on each other. <laughs> Curry gonna rush for six touchdowns, and Carl gonna throw for about five. I don't um, got prop bets and everything <laughs> for the game, man. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, but look, the line, we gonna move over to some more local New Orleans standout news, bro. We got Montreal Johnson with ULL, man. Four shout touchdowns out, shout tonight. Shout out Keated Keated Black. You know, Keated Keated Black the Keated Black, the You raising a, a, a you raising yeah, an dude. intelligent, humble young man. You raising a humble kid. What do you Ever have? since I've been on him, bro. Since he been in like ninth grade, with Pog Ball, but I got on him like when he yeah was, he went to Harrell, right? Then he come, they come off Harrell, him and Lenares and all them, but. All the play that De La Salle. Like, I'm familiar all, with him. I've been keeping up with him. All his Park Boy guys transferred out on him. Ain't like the system. He stayed down, became the captain of the team, one of the best backs to ever come through Louisiana, statistically. Pull it up. He wanted the best backs to come yeah, through. Bro, yeah, I he, know he was doing his thing week in, week out. Yeah, I was looking at him like, 250, hey, 260. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he cut off for ULL tonight, man. 13 carries, 84 yards, four touchdowns, man. <laughs> yeah, true freshman. On, what, it was on ESPN tonight? On ESPN On tonight. ESPN, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, shout out Montreal Johnson, man. He number four for ULL, right? Number four. Number four. For ULL, yeah. 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 Let's salute. Let's, let's salute youngin', man. Salute little Montreal, man. You dig? But, um, I don't nothing know with these youngins, bro. Trying to get off subject right I quick, just, bro. One thing, one more thing about him. Yeah, go ahead. LSU. What, what's really going yeah, on? Yeah, why is this dude in yeah, ULL? 
5'11", 6 feet, 220, running the 4'4", four, four, hit the hole. Shout out Coach Jaluk, too. You Jaluk know, know what's happening. Academically, you know, ready. Dude come from D. LaSalle, you know, he never been a problem, trouble kid or nothing. Like, I don't understand how this kid is not in Baton Rouge. I don't understand it. I don't understand how he not in Baton Rouge. <laughs> he look. He was a man amongst boys in high school, grown man. Yeah. You know, he got Leonard Fournette comparisons because of right. how, he, how he looked. Right. You know, he wasn't that hitter home run like Leonard, but dude got speed and everything. He he got the Leonard Fournette comparison. Same size as Leonard, you know, coming out of high school, Shit brother. Shed, Shout man. out to Montreal. Keep doing your thing, boy. It's a spot for you. Look at that dude that just left, Elijah Mitchell. ULL starting running yeah. back last year, toting it for Frisco yeah. right now. So he gonna go to the league. He, you know, stay healthy, pray on his health. Ain't nothing gonna stop that little dude. You dig? Ain't nothing gonna stop you, Montreal. Yes, indeed, man. But look, bro, get off subject right quick, bro. What's up? What's up with you know? What's going on, bro? Russell Westbrook, what's popping, man? What's popping? I knew we with this, you know, we free and uh, you know we do what we want and it's woody this new woody baby, woo. You know, it's this new shit. But it, I, it's confusing, my brother. I, I, you know, no lie, it's confusing, bro. bro. They putting it in their face, bro. We ain't got to really get into detail, bro. But I, I, I'm like agreeing with Boosie. They putting it. Everything, everything has that in it. Any form of life or what you got going on or. Any TV show you watch, brother, cartoons got it in it, brother. It's in, it's in shit that say huh, age is fucking 12. You know, it, I don't even like to get I on mean, that subject because it's too, it's, it's too it sensitive. It is, bro, but, but I just want to know, I don't know what's the on. why behind it. I mean, right? Is it is it we should just not give a fuck or? What's the why behind a photo shoot with a dress on? Nah, to each his own. That's what you're doing, brother. Why we got to have a photo? Yeah, you walk out on the street with a dress on, people are going to take a picture. Woo -de -woo -de -woo. But no, this is promoted. I mean, what, what, what we doing? He was in New York Fashion Week. That's this what week that was that, about? This week that just passed, everybody was in New York. It was New York Fashion Week. So, all right, the Met Gala and all that, that was just some pre-shit to all that. New York Fashion Week, brother. You know, Definitely but I, I would just hope we can, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Maybe you can enlighten us on why we yeah, wearing we these fuck. things. Or, you know, you know, come on you now. Know, we go all back. know, bro. You got to go back to Rodman. Set the trend. I, I, you can do anything. Rodman, Birdman, dudes like that. AI with the way he dressed, even though he was on our swag. I'm just thinking of these dudes, they look at themselves as characters now, bro. Basically, they looked at themselves as characters to the world right now. They playing a role. You're a character, bro. That's all. You know, you doing all that. You're a character. You know, what it's I'm like saying? you know. I don't. I don't want to knock this shit, and but I it's so it. different from what we accustomed it. to. Yeah, I ain't knocking. You know, I think. I think I'm good enough to keep my kids. To you it's know, an open mind frame and Russell, keep them. I make sure he, they know what's going on. Before they go to making decisions and shit, like Listen. just by seeing their role models doing some other shit. With him, I just think Russell Wes Russell Westbrook, his whole NBA career, like people respect him, but he has the other side of people that like give him a hard time. And he basically, since he's been in the league, has that I don't give a fuck type mentality. So he take that off the court to in real life. And you can see it, bro. I read people's body language and shit. That's how he live his life. Fuck you. I can do whatever I want. I'm Russell Westbrook. Not, not that I'm Russell. He'll be like that if he wasn't Russell Westbrook. Right. That's just his attitude. He's... He, he, people look at him different already, and he on some shit like, I'm going to show you I'm all the way different. I mean, you know. Type shit. He, he, he on the Dennis Rodman, brother. It's like a... He, he going that far, Dennis Rodman put a wedding dress on and shit. I mean, Dennis yeah, Rodman yeah, was more of a go, character. 
Mule you know, or some other is, freaky is, is, shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, just, you know. But no, he I think Westbrook on. just expressing himself yeah. in this fashion world or whatever. You know, he different like that. Yeah, sorry about shit. that. I can't compare that you to know, Dennis Rodman. You know, Dennis the color in the hand shit Dennis too. It's, it is a comparison, but and stuff and had habits and yeah, running around with Playboy girls and. And rave parties yeah. and it's just shit. a fast. Russell Westbrook ain't known none of it's that. Just it's just a fashion, the fashion and it's confusing. Yeah. And you know, I guess it's it's fashion. I guess that's what you gotta say it is, but mm-hmm. you know, but you know, I'm gonna keep mine straight it, and keep mine. You know, with a, I can't do that, bro. With a knowledgeable mind on it. My son better not ask me to. You know, I don't have a son, but <laughs> man, you know, just nah. And we ain't with that. We ain't putting on dresses. But to ease his home, put you on the dress. <laughs> you know, nah, I think I definitely got to say we ain't putting on dresses, bro. Like, if you end dress. up putting on a fucking dress later on, nah, like, it ain't got nothing to do with me. Like, that's what you wanted to do, but you that wasn't was taught true. that. You feel me? Fuck no. Fuck no. Shit no. We not going to uh-uh. But Shit you know. No. But ain't no gay bashing or nothing, man. Bro. We ain't going to like the, that. You know. But yeah, man, let's go. What was up with these Saints, man? Boy, what? Defense. What's happening, Wu? Five try- touchdowns, Wu. I'm calling it right now, Wu. You bro. did. We got the best defense in the league. Yeah, we got the best defense in the league, you, too. You're not doing that to Aaron Rodgers. Yeah, you're Week not. one, everybody on the field 100%. N- nobody can't talk about, oh, he was hurt this game, and the, so- the shoulder was so, and Aaron Rodgers was 100%. 100%. Yes, indeed. 38-3. Best day in the league, best coach in the league. Shout out to my partner, Money, Gertown. Shout out to Money, Gertown. I went on, look, I'm in, your, I'm in, I'm in Money Story. Quarterback. I'm in Money Story. That boy, Money, like, man, they taking Evan Rogers out the game. He showed the TV. It was 10 minutes left in the fourth quarter. Evan Rogers got benched. <laughs> Serious D. And we don't even want him to get hurt or nothing no more. He niggas out here hitting. 38-3, sit him down. Sit that smoke, man. Sit him down. This ball. Dennis Allen, the best Dennis defensive Allen. coordinator. He the best defensive coordinator in football, dog. He, he was top the, five in passing and rushing last year. We, and we back at it. Carolina, watch out, Carolina. Defense, he calling the best defensive plays in the league. Sam league, Darnold. Bro. I know he can't sleep at night right now. <laughs> I'm going to no tell way. you what type of team we got. Marshawn Lattimore, Look, 100 million. I got a good, <laughs> you I got, feel I, me? We gonna stay on the same, and I got a good comparison. This fucking season remind me, and this team remind me of, Jameis is the same situation Peyton Manning was when he arrived in Denver. We got the same type of team. We got the top fucking three defense, we about to lock you up. And we got Pete Man, and he ain't really about to fuck up. We got the Maris Thomas gonna kill you. We got a number one threat. Woo, we gonna keep this ball. We ain't gonna turn it over. And we gonna beat you with D. We got that same team like Denver when they fucked Cam Newton up in the Super Bowl. We this got that similar. same team. Yeah, it's similar. similar. But it's been our nice if we had Emmanuel Sanders. More, we got a little bit more explosive shit on offense, though, that Peyton in there. We got Kamara and shit. They had Demetrius Thomas, Emmanuel yeah, Demetrius Sanders. Yeah, man, I forgot who was told. Yeah, I forgot who was told. Yeah, I forgot who was told. Bro. But, yeah. Bro, Elvin Kamara and that arm is going to keep make safeties have a real decision to make, right? Man, it's going to be hard to beat the safety. Motherfucker just gave you a team in place. Nigga, I looked on my Instagram. They showed you uh, the Western Pass when you threw the 50-yard bomb to Callaway. The ball traveled 54 yards just in the air right, itself. Right. Drew Brees attempted 9,400 That ain't true, bro. Passes. It's not true, bro. No, he he never threw it. No, he threw 50-yard touchdown passes. Listen to what I'm about to tell you. That's not never, true what you're about to say. That's what I mean, I'm, bro. No, no. Listen I'm to not what, sure what you're talking about. No, I'm talking about something else. But NFL writers went over that. Listen, bro. He threw 50 yard touchdown. The ball never traveled out his hands for a completion. Well, the ball was 50 yards in the air itself. Nigga caught it and took it there with him. He never, the That's ball never was in the air itself. I don't believe that. Yeah, brother. I don't know, bro. 9,000 or something. I think he might have got about 40. 
Forty yeah. five. Yeah, forty five. Something nice. like that. Now, listen, the ball in the air. Yeah, you said in the air. air. No, bro, he ain't never do it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, what you read, that's you know the same thing, Peyton, and that's not true. It, he had one of the best offenses in the league for like ten years straight, right? And we couldn't throw the ball down the field, and motherfuckers knew that. Who said so, we couldn't throw the ball down the field? Shit, it's showing we couldn't stick to stats. What the fuck? Stats, my nigga, we couldn't push the ball down the field. Yeah, we couldn't Duh. push the ball down the that's, field. That's the last couple of years. What you mean? We right. couldn't. Drew Brees had a fucking arm, man. No, he didn't. He ain't had no cannon. He ain't had no fucking... Go back uh, and look at our shit. We never were stretching the ball down the field. Are you crazy? What you think we was Boy. doing with Devery Henderson and fucking Ted Ginn yeah, Jr.? Yeah, because you saw us do it a couple of times. Go look at the stats. We wasn't really doing that. What? Go. We, wasn't really doing that. we what? Go back where y'all was. Drew Brees could throw the ball, bro. That, we just, the man been in the league so long, is a microwave, you know, you, you're thinking about what just happened. That dude used to be throwing the ball, man. He did, bro. Like, he throwing the ball for He wasn't hitting motherfuckers. Robert Meacham and shit, man. But he dude, used to be it, having right. deep balls. He, he, like. Even if it wasn't the last, even if it was the last five years, I just say Sean Payton, Schemed up, used to scheme up shit to where as though you still couldn't stop our offense shit, and you like, know we like, couldn't go down the field. At the point when you know we couldn't go down the field, I got to get Sean oh, Payton's yeah, props. Right. So now that's why I say our offense really about to be unstoppable because he can dial up shit down the field now. Well, the ball could be in the air. It's a threat. 65 yards. It's a threat. So you know that, what I'm saying? That makes it like different. We, we could be first and 10 on the 20, and Jameis could hit a nigga with on the fly round, and he can catch the ball 60 yards down the field before the ball even dropping his hand and taking another 20 for an 80 yard bomb touchdown. Who wasn't doing that? We've been missing that for sure. I, and was I ain't gonna lie, I like the, the rookie ball. Callaway though. And then we just bought the reliable, or reliable Kenny Steele. We just bought the old reliable back. He know our system and everything. Yep. Plug him in, he don't so, got to practice. He ready. And, and what about the fact that he can see all of the receivers now? He don't have to look for lane. Man, we can't see that, man. No, man. Drew Brees is the best quarterback damn near ever. He the most so, accurate ever. I'm just saying. No, but what that mean that he couldn't see? The, he ain't mean nothing. Because yeah. he was hitting niggas he and he the best, you. most he accurate. He ain't mean nothing. He ain't mean so, nothing. So. Why? They got they got a bunch of six five quarterback. Wish they was Drew Brees. They could see like a motherfucker. No, but they, he could call <laughs> different shit. Not he couldn't call really slant. Drew Brees couldn't really throw the slants and all that. What? How, how he want? How they want with him? Cause it, they had, a nigga on, used man. to back down a lot of Drew Brees about, passes man. too. A lot of his passes used to get bad. All right, <laughs> quarterbacks passes get bad. No, but his was high. Man, no, son. He got the highest completion rate in history. He got that too. What the fuck? I mean, you can't be getting hit that much. I mean, That's accurate. a deflection. I mean, That's an incompletion. Accurate. I think Drew Brees' accuracy has to be what it has to be because he has to fit the ball where he got to fit the ball because he can't open the field like he was Man, no, man. That's any quarterback. All right. Any quarterback got to do what they got to do no, to get the I'm ball up. Patrick Mahomes threw this bitch sideways just because he had to throw that bitch sideways. Matthew Staff, I had to throw that bitch sideways. Let me ask you this. <coughs> if Jameis go clean lighter, off man. this year, what is Jameis' market? What you mean? 40 million a year. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He Dak Prescott, all them, yeah, yeah. All them niggas. Right, that's what I'm saying. Do he have to get the big money if he yeah, go out? you got to. If Jameis Winston gets to the motherfucking NFC Championship, NFC Championship he done threw for 40 touchdowns, <laughs> 5,000 yards, yards, he's going to ask for 400 million, 300 million. You know? I can see it. Say he's going to have to pay that boss. Five, five year, 200 million. Five year, 225, some shit. Say he's going to have to pay that boss. He's going to have to pay him. 
Oh, we're going to lose them. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Are you, yeah, I don't, you can't give them up. This man come out and play good the whole year. Look at what? Thing. Minnesota 11. Anybody. I mean. Bye, Kirk Cousins. Pittsburgh There's love so him. Team. Pittsburgh love him to play to replace Ben Roethlisberger. Washington, nigga, the Giants tonight. Right. They got Dan Jones and shit, mm-hmm. but come on, man, you got to do about who to do five. You know, if he do some shit this year. <coughs> but we got Carolina this week in Carolina. Don't overlook that. It's a tough division. You know, man. Sam Darnold. It. They looking all right. We got it. I like the Saints money line. The um, Saints, you know. Saints giving up three and a half that game. Mm-hmm. But uh maybe a tough game. Christian McCaffrey. Dante have a Camara matchup. Dante there. Jackson, L S U. I just don't think I don't think Carolina ready, bro. I don't think they're ready. I don't think they're ready. It may be tough as a like division C- game. Kristen, Kristen playing? Carolina D A playing. Yeah, he playing. <laughs> it it can be a tough game, Boy. though. But our See. defense is slow now. They defense is pretty good too, you know. Right. But I just don't think they're ready to with the new system and the new quarterback and all that. I don't think so. Yeah, bro. Uh, so let's get into some <laughs> NFL, bro. See, we had a, we had a, a nice week one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What you like? Tonight, what, what, what stood out in week one? Stood out week one to me, bro. We got we got Kyler Murray five touchdowns, full pass touchdown, one rush touchdown. Chandler Jones five beat, six. <coughs> Chandler Jones five six. These people came and beat beat Tennessee. A uh, 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 predictable. I called, it. I called that. You called it a predictable Super Bowl contender. <laughs> That's like a unanimous Super Come Bowl contender house, on the road. On the road, came out and showed out. Did they thing, man? Mm-hmm. DeAndre Hopkins did his thing. I think he had two touchdowns. Yeah. Um, Kyler Murray made some hell of a plays. Chandler Jones looked like the MVP. Like he's he's about to walk. He had five sacks, man. See, something just hit my mind. I'm about to give it to y'all right now. And every week we gonna give y'all this. It's called the trap game. It just came to my the mind. Trap game. The trap game. The trap game. Every That's week true. we gonna give you a trap game. Yeah, we gonna give you a, trap a trap game, game is they're trying to bait you in to take the good team, and the team and uh, and and the and the sad team is gonna That's upset. So you can see what we were talking about earlier. This with good your, team with your college weave. That's, yeah, you can put that under that. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Right. You feel me? You can right. put that under that. But yeah. But speaking on the trap game, and I'm gonna let you finish running it. Minnesota is playing. Arizona. Minnesota looked bad week one. Well, no, they ain't look bad. They lost in overtime. They, they did good. They lost in overtime to a young Cincinnati team. Yeah. That's up and then coming, right? Yeah. And Arizona just beat the sleeves off a Super Bowl contender, right? <coughs> I consider that a trap game. Now Arizona <coughs> giving three or something against Minnesota. It just looked like Arizona about to come. But you forgetting still Minnesota got a squad. It don't mean nothing that they lost to Cincinnati. You know what I'm saying? So that's my trap game of the week. I ain't even betting that. I, I ain't giving you no pick on it or nothing. Trap game of the week. Trap game. You did Minnesota, <laughs> Arizona. But back to week one, no. You feel me? Kyler Murray went off. Winston went off. Five touchdowns with a, only six incompletions. Um, David Cardinal, man, they, they played a, a good ass the second half. You know what I'm saying? To come back and do their thing, David. Cardinal. The Raiders got some good young talent, bro. Baltimore, bro. Lamar don't fumble, they win. You feel mm-hmm. me? <laughs> he played a good game. Lamar don't fumble, they, they should they should get it out. That was a good game. Joe Burrow, now, you know, everything look identical with chasing and chasing and Burrow. You know, that's just crazy, you got, bro. You got some shit about to happen in Cincinnati, bro. <laughs> Plain and simple. That's just crazy. You got some shit about bro. to happen. Joe Burrow looked like the Tom Brady that they should have saw back in Michigan. Mm-hmm. They didn't see it, right? But you know, time didn't put up the numbers like it all. It nothing matched up. He looked like Tom Brady that. 
played in the NFL and then played his last college season. But what at Joe LSU. really don't get credit for? Joe can move. He's an athletic. Yeah, he's Joe athletic. can move. Yeah, he can move. Joe can you really know, move. The fire part about it, he ain't even got to. Nope. I ain't gonna say he ain't got to, cause he make big plays on his feet. Mm-hmm. But he's deadly from the pocket. pocket. I mean, he he, he got it. <laughs> you right. know, they say his smarts and his pre pre snap shit off the chain. Yeah. I guess this not a surprise. Pat Mahomes being Pat Mahomes. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Well, I was so scared for my money. Man, Cleveland, I, I, bro. I, I won with Cleveland. They went for two. If they get the two point conversion, I lose my money. They didn't get it. I was getting five, and I and they, and I lost by four. It's the thing. Come Cleveland, back, Cleveland, here, good, bro. bro. Cleveland, good. They gonna be. Good. I got Cleveland beating them when it matter. Cleveland, good. But I just show you, bro. Pat Mahomes. Just imagine if they be clicking. <sighs> They don't even be clicking. They ain't last the whole last shit. They really wasn't clicking. Clicking, It was winning every game by single digits and shit. By less than, you know, one possession. They didn't click until the second half, to the full quarter. Man, I was down by 12 in the full quarter. Came back, won a game. That shit is not surprising, but it's so beautiful where it's like, it's like I went skydiving. The dude who took a skydiving, he said, this shit, everyone is different. And you feel me? You could do this shit every day and it's still gonna be different. And see, what's real crazy about that, though, you got Lamont, him, and Burrow in the same division, bro. Lamont, Lamont. Lamont, man. Patrick. L- no, Lamont. Not Patrick, no. No, Patrick Mahomes ain't in that division. Mm-hmm. But no, I mean all of them in the AFC. All of them in the Basically, AFC. they gonna be going Burrow, they gonna be going ben, this the quarterback's gonna be going at each other for these chips. And big Mayfield. Yeah. But everybody think it's gonna be Lamar against Patrick Mahomes. But I think years to come, it's about to be Burrow and Mahomes. I think it's going to be Joe Burrow versus Mahomes trying to get to these rings. Like Peyton Manning and Brady was always meeting in that little seven-year span. Every other year, Peyton and Brady meeting the NFC Championship game. Peyton to win, then Brady to win, you know, like they kept meeting. Yeah. I see this going on with Kansas City and Cincinnati in the future. I mean, that's who Joe Burrow gonna be winning some games. Bro. That's that's who Burrow gonna be having to go. I mean, that's who uh, Pat gonna be having to beat to go to these Super Bowls. He gonna be having to be because he got the Burrow got a team around him, brother. Not but top he got notch offensive weapons. T Higgins and them dudes. Go. The offensive Man. weapons. If the coaching staff could pull out some play, some reasonable defense. They say the coach Zach Taylor. He's supposed to be this offensive genius, brother. You ain't hear about him. Mm-mm. Zach Taylor. He's supposed to be. I'm not on. I'm not know, on him yet. Like I'm not on them type of time. Yeah, so yeah, that's a new thing. He's gonna get these young minds right now. Yeah. No, I, now True. look, I don't really think he a young boy. I don't think he a Hello? young boy, Zach Taylor. I'm not sure, but I don't think he a young boy. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? I think he a vet or something, but and they play good D. Cincinnati always play good D. Shit chat. So, you know, that was my my excitement of week one. Good little week one. We our picks came through for the most part. We had um, oh. the picks we gave on Instagram for last week. I ain't, we ain't going to the picks just yet, but the picks we got, I just want to talk about the ones we did. On Instagram, we gave you the Coast Money line that that, that um, bonged out on us against Seattle. What we gave them, um, we gave them the Over in the Cincy, oh, Minnesota. The Cincy, Minnesota. That hit. We gave them Pittsburgh with the points. With the points. So Pittsburgh covered. And we gave you... Uh, The Saints. I think we gave them the under and something. The under and the, the, the Miami the under Patriots. The Miami Patriots. The Miami Patriots. So yeah. that, that one here we give you on Instagram. One thing before on we show, uh, though, on, on the show, you spent Arizona. Arizona, I said Arizona on the show. Arizona did their thing. That was my number one pick. I mentioned Cincy. 
I thought since it was going to win money, you know, I pulled it off. Right. But, you know, we had a good week picking wise, too, though. What you was about to get at? Forgot to ask you how you feel about Jalen Hurts, man. Man, Jalen Hurts played a good game, bro. Jalen Hurts played a good game, bro. Bro. I, I always I, did like the the running quarterback with their chances to win. I know. I guess they know they'll probably figure it out and feel like they can't really win championships with just a running quarterback. But he, they could throw the ball, man. We just got to get these dudes opportunity. Listen. He throwing that rock, man. Devontae Smith and them, man. Miles I Sanders. I don't, I don't uh, want to compare him to Brady's legacy, but he might be another – type of Tom Brady type player. When I say this, is do overlook. Overlook. Ever since I've been watching him, he got better every year, brother. Dude got better every year. When he got benched and all that, he was humble. He stayed. He, he never, you know, he always just played his role and just waited his time. So, like, when he was a senior or whatever, he got the graduate transfer and he transferred to Oklahoma. Showed you I could I could win from the pocket because in Oklahoma you gonna win from the pocket. You know that boy they trying to get you in the NFL, right? Yeah, the coach. No, no, I'm talking about the mm. coach who had mm-hmm. Manziel and, 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 and yeah, yeah, the coach. Anyway, uh, what I was saying, yeah, he threw for all the yards at Oklahoma. I said all that to say with the Tom Brady situation, he got better. And better every year, mm-hmm. and I said the Tom Brady situation. He he could be that of his generation by meaning everybody overlooked him. You knew about him and everything. Like you know, Brady was the star quarterback from Michigan, winning games, and you know about Jalen Hurts, Alabama. They playing in the championship game, but nobody thought he had what it take. Looked like he gonna be the one that's about to be. I see. He 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 the one that's about to turn. He just he put up a list. Special. They just put up a list of the ages of the starting quarterbacks in the league. Dog, they all 24, 25, 26, 27. Man. Like it's only a few of them up there. It's Aaron Rodgers, Tom. It's gonna go back to him. Matthew old. Stafford. The league just redoing it with the quarterback. Oh no, right but now. they all was good. It's like most of them was <laughs> was ballers. You know, Pat Mahomes right. and Josh Allen and um some young cats. Justin Lamar. From, um Justin from uh, the Chargers. Herbert. Lamar Lamar. Mm. Kyler Murray. Them dudes young, yeah, man. Lamar. Yes indeed, boy. Dudes young. Well, brother, Sam yeah. Darnold. Sam Darnold, yeah. You know, Joe Burrow. Yeah. Like, when you saw the name, I'm like, man, they ain't really missing on <laughs> Daniel oh. Jones. Daniel Jones, you know. Say, Bridgewater bro. shit. Bridgewater in the yeah. middle. Say, bro, that dude look good, though. I think Hurts going to be a real pro. You look good. I think Hurts going to be a pro, I brother. Impressed. I think Jalen Hurts going to be a pro. Because nobody he beat us. I'm, when he beat us last year. Yeah. We, we was on the street. Look, nobody Philly. showed me. He 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 let me know he, he was he was ready. He Look. come play a top defense like that, man. I'm gonna tell you the difference between a lot of people. The difference between the best and the best other best is attention to detail and shit. Certain niggas be real good and just made it all the way through with raw shit. And certain niggas don't have them type of talents or athletic abilities to do what the person do straight raw. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like... Yeah, some people just got it and some people just don't. But... They have some people that's that's like coachable, bro. Like some people, you can show them this place, show them how to run it, and boom, he cold as a motherfucker. He gonna run it similar to it, and he still gonna do good with it. And you gonna accept it because he's so raw and woo woo. When Jalen Hurts gonna come, 
and he gonna do it exactly the way the coach said it. He one of them type of players. Was ever laid out to him this play of anything, he gonna do it the exact. Yeah. He gonna do it the exact way, brother. If you get what I'm saying, dog. He one of them type of players, Man, brother. Who else want to I like see, his though? attitude, dog. Man, motherfucking uh. Jalen Ramsey, bro. He 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 stood out <laughs> again to me, bro. Down to the different breed, bro. Down, Aaron Down to this thing too. But man, I didn't I didn't know this. I didn't I didn't know this. I knew this, but I didn't know this. Dog, Jalen Ramsey is physical, nigga. Oh yeah. Big old corn. He you coming up trying time? to hit. Tyreek got the ooh. pass on him, but that boy was beating Tyreek up at the line. That's why Tyreek couldn't do nothing. Look, you're a little boy. Stay right here. Yeah, hey. Right here. Big old con. He kind of physically ain't scared to hit. Yeah, ain't on him. I said, man, Jalen, I ain't not know you know. Boy, Jalen's six feet, six feet one. Yeah, one, you know, one eighty. about six three or something. Yeah. He yeah. tall. Yeah. He tall. I think he about six two, six three. Tall. You know, really like that but I, I I noticed that with Lattimore too. Lattimore ain't really ducking no ducking no action, but uh, coming hitting everything. He coming hit you and everything. Jalen, it just boom. He, he just speaking of Lattimore, two. Your life. Speaking of Lattimore, <laughs> God rest the dead. <laughs> that woman got that that woman writing them checks. Now see, when you ever heard of a Saints cornerback being the highest paid in the league, nine to seven million dollars corner, sixty three million guaranteed. But I bet someone getting that boy the money. <laughs> <laughs> boy Benson when they get that boy the money, see? <laughs> Shout out to Gail Benson. Tom, Tom <laughs> wasn't popping it all. <laughs> Tom wasn't popping it all, baby. Lattimore, boy, them checks getting cut. People come and play for the Saints, not Gail popping it all. <laughs> yeah. Keep him here, man. <laughs> Gail popping it all. Remember, yeah, we, were just, we assigned people to the early contract and let them go. That was our scheme. Think about they, all the Saints they, they players. We did some shit somewhere else. <laughs> yeah, think about all the Saints players. We going to get them, and we, we always like to build out the draft. But, it, it, you know, that's kind of the Patriot way. New England do it, too. We going to build oh, you up. We been good, bro. Check Sean out. Sean Payton, no, we been good, Yeah, man. That's, that's why I say making loomers, bro. You doing good. Right. Now get the Pelicans to somebody else, bro. Yeah, did get the Pelicans up, man. Yeah, if I get the Pelicans, you can't run you both of them. Make it tripping. Yeah, yeah, make it. You can't run both of them, brother. <laughs> yeah, he doing good full with the Saints. You went got Dennis Allen and shit. He doing good with the Saints. He's full of them. For real, brother. He doing good with the Saints, bro. Yeah, bro. So. You know, and um, bro, it was it was one more. It was another game we had mentioned. We did talk about, we did the show Thursday. We started off talking about Dallas. We went over the Dallas game. We went over the Dallas yeah. game. We, we went over the you know, yeah, Dallas we, table, we, good-ass game. We good won ass game. opening game. And we went over Tabble the Dallas game. Uh, we talked about it already, though, yeah. But, um, you know. Yeah, let's, uh, let's talk about this NFC West right quick. Bro. You see Arizona, Seattle, Frisco, oh, nah. and, and the Rams, the brother. They div- their division went undefeated week one. Yeah, you can't play when you come and play against them. Who one. not going to the playoffs, brother, it's in crazy. that division? It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Who not going, brother? Somebody. Somebody's going to fall off. Injury or something. something. It ain't going to be the, even if it's in losses because – they gonna beat up. They on said each other. three gone out that division. Three gone. By they go got to. that next that extra game. They said three gone out that division. Yeah, three should go. They four. They all look like they are gonna be good enough <laughs> to go. So it's gonna be tough beating them when they playing outside the division. Good luck. You feel me? Good I ain't luck. gonna lie. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a call it right now in that division. I'm going to say I'm not going to call a winner, and then I'm going to call who not going to go. I must just say just I'm going to say Frisco not going to go, and not because they don't have the talent to go. They the only one in the division that don't have the for sure quarterback situation. They're running a two-quarterback system. Now, they might fuck the league up with it. 
They might be successful like the Saints use Taysom. They might use, because, you know, uh, what his name is, Shanahan, he is a genius, fuck, you know, with his like, offense and shit. So it might work, but I'm going to pick them not to make it just off of Kyler Murray and them running around. They got too much talent on the field. You ain't going to keep them out the playoffs. All right, Russell Wilson, you ain't going to keep them out the playoffs. And then you got the best defense in the league with the Rams. With a quarterback. See, I'm with not Stafford. sure what full nine defense going to do this year. It's they going to show up. Because that's my. Well, I, I, they're I, playing D. They ain't played no D this first week. They ain't played no D, right, no D this me? first week. You're right. You're right. I know Shanahan going to be able to dip Scopes. and dab and get some points on the board. You feel me? With whoever at quarterback, right. I feel like. Yeah, whoever at quarterback, that nah. dude got a system. Yeah. Nah, if he, yeah, if he had a, a for sure quarterback, Trey Lance end up being something, it may be better for him. But I feel like for nine, one who ain't going to make it either. Part quarterback and part, I'm not for sure on the defense. defense. I'm not for sure on it. That's why I can't really pick the division winner. Because... Cardinals defense looking like it could be better than St. Louis with Chandler Jones and J.J. Watt on the line, brother. You got Chandler Jones and J.J. Watt. People forgetting about that. Like they got Gavin and Clowney. You got that boy and J.J. Watt. You got that boy Murphy. They let Pat Pete yeah, go. They, they didn't give Pat Pete the no more. Too, they, yeah, and they got yeah, Murphy they over here. Line. And they got Boo the Baker just roaming the neck. The new honey badger. Boo the Baker. Round this bitch. And they got your boy who played D.N. linebacker and safety. Running the full four Simmons. Yeah, from, uh, <laughs> from Clemson. From Clemson, yeah. <laughs> They souped up, bro. It's tough, bro. That that division tough. tough. Yeah, that division impressing me, though. I, I, you know, we seen it coming. Woo. You know, I think we talked about it on a couple of shows. I mean, we saw it coming, but to actually see it week one, like, man, I knew coming it. Yeah. They coming with it. It just man. looked like go with their division. So, I guess we could go ahead, go I with our we fucking we picks. We're going to have one team go. Because y'all just said, NFC West, if three, if three going, then somebody in the NFC going to have one team going. What you three mean? Not make it. Everybody can't make it. Yeah, three could go out one division. You know what I'm saying? Three could, one, three so could three without the extra one. game. They got another one where only one going to go, that top one. Yeah, they got two more. What, the top one going to go? The two top ones going to go. But they got seven going now, they said it more. Yeah, look. I think it's a 17. I don't know. Some she probably playing games. Some I don't know. I forgot what it is, but But 16. So, you know, you got the two division winners and if three coming out of there. Yeah. So, yeah, you're going to have one with one. Yeah. You got one with one. So, who is that? It ain't going to be the South. It's going to be the know. East. It's gonna be the yeah, it's going to be the only, East. The only team yeah. ain't going to the playoffs is yeah. Dallas. Dallas gonna make the playoffs and everybody else not. It's the NFC East. Yeah. One team coming out that bitch. One team came last year, Washington. Yeah. Without the extra that, game. It was fight for the division. Yeah, without Jump the extra game. The East. Boy, them Cowboys <laughs> niggas <laughs> sick. Man, look. I'm fucking with the Cowboys no, this I'm year as far as their team, That's but Cowboys can man. We, man, we can make everybody look. We can play possum all year. Cowboys can play possum. We gonna get <laughs> through this motherfucking season yeah. and let everybody write us home. Everybody know we got the talent, man. We just focusing on the division. All we gotta do is beat our poo ass division. Yeah. That's all we gotta do is win eight games, beat our poo ass division. We in. Yeah. Yeah, but it's football. You know, you got to try with it. Yeah, but I feel you, though. <laughs> Fuck that. We ain't going to show nothing to the outside. Yeah. yeah. Boom, 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 and be ready, you know, yeah. sitting niggas and everything. Yeah. Like. <laughs> be but, ready um, for our division, for the blow them bitches up. Sit down. I, I think we could go ahead with our picks with the NFL, and then we could, hit, you could finish with your college. Get our, give our first college yeah. picks up in the, yeah. the NFL first. Yeah, we're going to give yeah, our you NFL go ahead. picks, you, man. You, 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 could, you could start gonna, it off. We're going to go with our picks for this week. We can't fuck with the uh, Giants Washington game. That was tonight. Washington 130 to 29. Good, good little game. 
you know, up and coming quarterbacks. They played good, you know. I feel like it was a garbage bowl that turned out right. <laughs> it you was a me? garbage bowl that turned out right, yeah. You know that. But, um, so, I got a few picks for this week, man. I kind of, you know, I kind of looked over it a little bit, you know. But, um. Oh, yeah. You got an oh, yeah, but fuck. I, I That's how it. I felt when I saw this one, too. Listen, nah, you feel I, I me? I don't know if, if me and you on the oh, yeah. I baby. don't know. We, Listen, I got an oh, yeah, I but a, you, you a, did. Oh, yeah. But um, the my Rams first one. Over the, park, the uh, over the coast, brother. You like the Rams over the coast Coast at home? Yeah, coast at home. Carson that West. wasn't my oh, yeah. Car- sure. Carson, Carson West, what you going to do? Hot. Donald. You can't Donald, move. yeah, he can't do too much. But and Rams, they only got no receivers. And we're going to take away whatever receiver we want yeah, with Rams. Out here. Yeah, it's kind of hard. They got a little running back and shit, but Boy, it's going to be tough. And, uh, nah, my, my all yeah was, man, I like Cleveland to beat the brakes off Houston, bro. Now, look, this uh, this ain't the trap game. This the had you fucked up game. Yeah. Houston played good. Tyrod Taylor, right? Who they played? Jacksonville. He uh, went uh, off, did his little thing, and I fuck, fuck with Tyrod. I like Tyrod Taylor. But he about to meet Cleveland, a team who pretty much could have won the game against one of the best teams in the league, which they one of the best teams in the league. It's a big difference from playing Jacksonville than Cleveland right now. If you know, that's that's not normal for us to say that. That's usually I'm I'm, I'm like this the here. same shit. Once Cleveland really really but, really getting it on, together on defense, like you're not gonna even really be scoring on them. I'm not saying Tyrod Ted, this might be hard for him. He might end up with seven, ten points this game. Right. Period. That might be it. Right. I like Cleveland giving up the 12 and a half. That's my oh yeah. That's my all oh yeah for this week. People may think you can take them 12. Cause woo, woo, Tyrod, cause woo, woo. No, man. Miles Garrett. And though. Uh, clown it. That D is going to smother these people, man. Another one I'm going to Nick get Chubb and them going to cut up, man. They showed me from week one because. You know, I know how people think. Uh, yeah, man, they got blown out last week. That Tennessee gonna bounce back this week. They show you Vegas, show you they ain't gonna bounce back. Come back the next week, getting six. Seattle cover, baby. Seattle cover. Seattle lock Sunday. Seattle lock. Tennessee don't got no defense, brother. They can have Derrick Henry and all that, all they want. The fucking school gonna end up 36-24. Seattle. Yeah, it's going to be a good game. 36-24 Seattle, though. 31-17 Seattle. It's going to be a good game. Seattle going to pull away. Them bitches defense garbage. Uh, um, Tennessee defense garbage. Super Bowl contender and all that. You know, now you getting six week two. I don't think Tennessee D garbage. They D is. They finished third and one in the league last year. And defense. See, I thought their defense was all right and shit. Keyshawn Johnson was just on that, like, you know, we got to, we got to, we got to, we, nobody's getting on uh, their coach. Yeah, they coach the defense. He's a defensive dude. coach, and how you got this terrible defense? Since you've been there, your defense been terrible. No, Not good. man. Pull it Not up. since he's been there, huh? Terrible. I want to say he had a good year. I just watched it on first take this morning, bro. They was talking about him, Steven, and them, like, how nobody's talking about how he a defensive coach. Coach, you got this good offense, Derrick Henry. Them you run ten here, but your defense garbage. You got a back end of the NFL yeah. defense. 26 yeah, that's on, probably what it been. Twenty six on been that down. Attention ain't they been on it because I knew Tennessee had a good D. Yeah, but you saying it wasn't with him though. Not with him. I thought he had some good year with. No, remember oh. when Dick LeBeau and shit was the fucking offensive with the, with the, with the coach. I do been there about about. About four years now. Yeah, so. and this defense been garbage. Go back and look. Garbage, bro. Uh, man, it had to be just last year, though. Not just last year. Michael Griffin and man season and shit, though, doing them. They had ball, talent. Man. But statistically, give up punts and yards and shit every game. They ranked in the 20s. Gotta look that they up ranked again. in the 20s on down every year. They defense. He he ain't have a top. Even top like eighteen defense or something yet. Hmm. Well, my other my other pick, which I feel like is a it's a it's a good pick. I, I like the over and um, the Chargers Dallas game, man. 
Dagnum going to throw the oh, ball. Oh, yeah, and Herbert going to sling the ball. Herbert going to sling the ball. Dallas got a few defensive players missing. It may it may it may turn into a college game out there in in in, um, in LA. Are they playing in LA like yet? A, I got the Chargers over. playing in LA yet? Or are they still no, playing? They playing in San Diego. No, they the LA Chargers. Yeah. They playing in LA Sci-Fi Stadium. They, they sharing play- the stadium. No, they, they got their, their own, own stadium. stadium. Yeah. Rams got a new stadium, and they got a new stadium. And they got a new stadium, too. Well, all right. But the it Super may Bowl, look like a college Super game. The Super Bowl is at the Rams stadium this year. At the Rams stadium. The Rams. Justin A. Bell, wait, wait. You went to East Oregon. State, Oregon. This may look like a Mississippi State-Oregon game. Yeah, I'm going to give you out another there, over. Out there in L.A. I got it over for you, too. Pittsburgh and Vegas, 47. I like that over. Derek Carr going to slang on the pressure on Gruden, them. they got to start scoring points, and, you know. They, they ain't really scored points like that last game. That was like at Pittsburgh, though. No? At, at Pittsburgh, yeah. Go well, across the. That's why I'm saying I'm reading the line. It's it's four to seven, and Pittsburgh like got this top notch defense, but but the over and under in this game four to seven. Cause they gonna score thirty. See, that's what's gonna happen. They gonna score thirty. And they might give up the 17 or some shit. They going to score 30 on Vegas. Vegas ain't got no defense. That's my two. I like Cleveland. I like the over and the Chargers. Ooh. Dallas Ooh. game. Damn. I like Cleveland giving up the 12. This a, this a, this a, this, 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 this a tricky game right here. <laughs> Cincinnati and the Bears. Yeah, cause I don't, I don't pick up. on the Bears like that. I don't. I look at rosters and shit. Boy, they got Khalil Mack, them, you know, Eddie Jackson, them the people got a defense, you know. And they got talent. They got your boy, not nah, man. Uh, Marquise Goodwin, them and shit. Got down the field, and, and and fields look too good for me. But what the Bears waiting on? And it don't. Probably better than that man right, right now. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Andy Dalton ain't no just no junk ass quarterback. I fuck with Andy. But Dalton. I don't think it's that far like how Alex Smith was in front pack. Like, I just think Alex Smith was just. How we know how far that was? Alex Smith was winning games, going in the playoffs and shit, bro. Yeah, I'm just saying though. Andy Dalton. Andy Dalton was doing the same thing Alex Smith was doing, though. To be real, think about it. Same fucking thing. Getting to the playoffs, losing. Getting there and losing. Winning 10 games, 11 games, 9 games, getting in that bitch and losing. All Alex Smith did. So what? (laughs) That's all he did. He was just a solid quarterback who don't make no mistakes. Andy Doe was in Cincinnati. Dude, I, I fuck with Andy Doe. Just sling that bitch. Him and AJ Green was doing So I already know if you just about to put him in some um, battle shit. Right. Man, he going to come out here and throw the ball, man. I'm at an NFL quarterback, man. He's going to be hard to beat a dude who's been starting, you know, six, seven years, however long he started. They're going to go with Fields in like week four. Yeah, they might have to go with him because he may be the future. He's playing every game. And the dope might be better than Justin Fields this whole year. To be real, he might be the better quarterback. You know, some people, you know, they may not feel that. Hey, show this thing. I yeah, already told game. you. I, oh, I got to see more Justin Fields. Played the COVID year. He played like six games or something. I ain't see that shit. You feel me? But the year before. Yeah, before he did his thing, but it wasn't that cold. You know what I'm saying? Wasn't no, like, Joe Burrow yeah. You feel me? I ain't gonna lie, that Clemson game showed you that when you took that hit, played with that, all that was, like, bruised real bad. He might be it. I just want to see more, so, you know. That's all I like just, Wilson, though, brother. I like Zach, Zach Wilson. Wilson. Yeah, I got to see more from him, too. He looked good, too. Justin Fields looked good, too, but I got to see more. So, Jamal boom. Chase, brother. Ain't, huh? Jamal Chase. 
Jamal Chase, Joe Burrow, bro. T. Higgins. Can Chase end up being the best receiver? Can, can Jamal Chase end up being the best wide receiver in the league? Yeah. I'm going to say yeah. I mean, he got potential. <laughs> but you know. Justin Jefferson, too. It's crazy, you know. Receivers, that shit hard for the outside looking in to just see who could be Ooh. the best receiver in the league. Like, you know what I'm saying? You can see a bunch of them with potential. To do it, you know what I'm saying? So much he's got the potential, you know, for sure. Stephon Diggs got the potential. And, you know, ain't like he's six four fast as you know. This man, six feet tall or something. The ball. You and know? like I always tell people, if he 100%, he can be the best in the league. Odell. Odell look good right now, bro. Odell. The way he run. Odell Beckham. Yeah, he, he, he got to Got to get back on the field first, shit. But yeah, fucking right. <laughs> he ain't even play yet. Uh, I know. seen him working out this shit. Yeah, I th- I, I, he looked like he could be ready, but I hold him back too. Y'all got a squad, mm. man. Play that smart. Boy, play that that's smart. That's Odell, Jarvis man. Jarvis going to hold it down? Yeah, man. that's Odell. <laughs> that's Odell, brother. You get him back healthy. Come on, man. You ain't see KC with Odell yet, you know. When you see him next time, you got 13 on the field. Yeah, you got 13 on the field. Y'all got Tyreek, we got Odell. Let's do it. Right. But football back, baby. <laughs> football back. Football back, brother. Football back, yeah, man. Football back. You know, we ain't really get on college too, too much yet because you know it's the first two, three weeks. It's bullshit. But now they're getting in the over. conference it's play. About, when they're getting the conference play and all that, you know, we jumping on it. You know, we're going to get on LSU ass. They better come back and do what the fuck they need to do. Lock. Straight up. You yeah, know, lock this week. They're calling the lock. They're giving up 19 yeah. to who, whoever they playing. <laughs> Central Michigan. But <laughs> Noodles got two good picks for y'all with the college. I'm going to lay back with the college. Yet it ain't real enough for me to get it. You know, I, I, don't, I don't pick it like that. I wait till it's real and I give you my college picks. NFL though, I give you what we what we got what we working yeah, with. Yeah, I'm gonna give you two lace, college lace picks. Up news. I'm gonna lay y'all up. Yeah, man. I don't really be counting the home team as a free pick as a pick, but uh, you know LSU don't count as a pick. They're a lot. Uh. Oh, yeah. Auburn. Auburn plus five against Penn State. Penn State at home, number 12 team in the country. Auburn, number 20 team in the country, SEC. You know, come mess around and be in the national championship. That's just how SEC schools is. You just don't know. But you know they got that talent on the field. It's Auburn. I see, I see Auburn wearing Penn State down. Uh-huh. See, that's a my bet. All the SEC two team playing out the conference. With the three year quarter. I take it most of the time. Bo Nix, with the three year start. I don't even gotta hear about the everything else. I mean, I know about Bo Nix and what I ain't sure what's going and on. Like I Auburn. told you, he beat Penn Alabama State. SEC when they school, was loaded go. with all their talent. All them dudes that's in the NFL right now, they beat Alabama when they he beat Alabama when they had all them. Bo Nix. So we got Auburn, our first pick. Yeah. What you got? What you got? One more, baby. Let's send them. Let's make them some bread, bro. You know, we gonna put these bets in too, man. We lacing them up. Yeah. Ole Miss giving two lane fourteen. Who you like? Old Miss. Old Miss. Yeah. Two yeah. lane playing good. Yeah, they huh? playing good. You getting ready for Ole Miss? Boy, Lane Kiffin. Oh, he gonna he gonna score fifty sixty on you. <laughs> it's gonna be close. Corral, <laughs> that boy that boy Corral, hides my trophy. Where they Canada. play at? They don't play down here. In huh? Ole Miss. About to see, they ain't bring old Mister Uptown, huh? Uh uh-uh, uh, they ain't bring him off Claybone. Like Tulane, the stadium. Tulane. I never been there. I never, never, been never I never got to see a game yet. But I want to put this out there. Man, recruit New Orleans. Too late. Recruit New Orleans. 
I some, think they're getting a little recruiting in New Orleans. Not something they're not doing right, dude. They're not getting the tiers. They're not getting the. They're not getting the top tier players. You know what it is, dude. Well, I, I, I think this is what it is. I was told this is what it is. The, um, the acceptance, your grade point average, what it need to be to get into Lane. Right. 